1960 in Ghana, where the protest for the March for Justice has kicked off in the capital, Accra. Still in the region, Human Rights Watch says Senegal needs to revise a new anti-terror legislation because it could stifle government criticisms by punishing political speech and protests as terrorist acts. In South Africa, prosecutors have announced a key step in their bid to extradite Indian-born Gupta brothers who were allegedly at the center of a massive web of corruption involving the former president, Jacob Zuma. And finally, to the east of the continent, Ethiopia's Prime Minister, Abiy Ahmed, says the country will cut the number of embassies as it has in foreign countries from around 60 to around 30 embassies. And that concludes the News in 60. I am Rita Omodian.